Hey, what's up guys? It's Skytoon Amiibo Gaming here, and if you're watching this video, you have officially survived the worst year of all time. Welcome to 2021. Alright, so I'm gonna talk about a few things. First up is unboxings. Unboxings will literally never go away. That is where I open something up, whether it's a game or an amiibo or something like that. So be looking forward to some more unboxings this year. Something else that's also not going away is product reviews. A product review is if I get an item, I'll review it, you know, give it either 10 out of 10 or something else and just kind of see what I think about it. Pretty straightforward. The next thing is vlogs. So. Last year, vlogs were very, 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 very hard to come by just because of the situation that we were in and that we are still in. So I'm going to try to do some vlogs this year, depending on if there's an event or something like that. Stay tuned. We'll see if I'm even able to do that. But I don't know what the future holds yet. So vlogs will probably be happening this year. As for skits, most of my skits, if I do them, are within a YouTube video already. So maybe I'll see a skit from time to time. I usually do one over Halloween, things like that. We'll see. Ooh, this is a new one. Top 10s. So top 10 things to do in this game or top 10 characters that I like in this game, something like that. So I want to try to do some kind of rating system this year. I think those videos are really fun to make. Depending on what the video would be about, maybe expect some top 10 videos or top five or top something. I just think that those would be some interesting opinionated videos that you don't really get that much from me. Last year, I tried to work really, really, really hard and upload news for you guys. And that was quite a struggle, whether it was the new games coming out at the beginning of the month and trying to get that video out in time or all of the Mario Kart tour news that I did when I was trying to get it out like while it was still relevant to I always wanted to do something more like maybe add pre-orders to the list and hey in your region you can get this pre-order and this one and put that video out as a news type video before pre-orders for a game would start things like that News was a very big thing. You could add a lot to it. You could make a whole bunch of different content for that, which is why I think a lot of you noticed that I stopped doing news last year. It really did become too difficult, but I'm not saying that I can't do it again, but hear me out. All of the content that I'm telling you that is going to be happening this year, it will be happening, but I just need to let you guys know that where my life is right now, I don't think that it's going to be consistent. And I know as a YouTuber, to be a good YouTuber, I've done my research, that you need to have consistency. You need to be able to say, this day is when I'm going to make a video each week. You got to have a plan for this. As consistent as I used to be in maybe... 2018, I think I really did keep up with the one week video promise. You can just tell from last year that that was not possible. As a lot of you guys know, the people that enjoyed gameplays and live streams on this channel, I did start Twitch in 2020. Twitch is the place where I do all of my walkthroughs, gameplays, they're obviously in the form of live streams, so none of that is going to be happening on this channel. I want to do something fun though, where I bring some of that content over to here in hopes that maybe you'll join the Twitch community where I'm active every single day on two different channels. There's a wide variety of content, but ever since I started Twitch, how this kind of all wraps together is that the things that I wanted to do, the news videos, the unboxings, the product reviews, all of that, videos in general have been really hard to come by because I'm putting all of my effort into Twitch. I'm definitely going to go way more on YouTube than I did at the end of last year. It's just 
Don't expect any consistency from me at all. If you want to subscribe, that's fantastic. But I can't seem to get a for sure grasp of times that I'm going to be uploading. Essentially, all of that means in a much simpler version that I'm going to be uploading videos on this channel of content that I want to upload whenever I want to upload it. If you're okay with that, then thank you. I hope that everybody understands that. I'm a full-time college student. I have a part-time job. I do Twitch. I do a whole bunch of stuff. I have a life, believe it or not. But YouTube is unfortunately going to be coming second other than Twitch moving forward. That's really everything that you can expect this year. I hope everybody's excited. I'm really going to try my best to get my footing back on YouTube do some new things, do some old things. You know, I just want to have fun with it. That's the bottom line. And I hope you guys will continue to join me for this ride. If everything I said about Twitch did interest you, which I 100% recommend, then do me a favor, click the two links down in the description below. I have two Twitch channels, one for Nintendo content and one for PlayStation content. It's kind of to separate the content a little bit based on what people enjoy. I don't mention this enough on YouTube, but we also have a Discord. So if you'd like to join the Discord as well, then be sure to click the link down in the description. There's a great community. Everybody is super nice. I love it. You'll definitely love it. My Instagram and Twitter are also down in the description below. These are all just ways that you can talk to me and interact and continue to have a good time without me uploading YouTube videos all of the time. I think recap videos we're also going to bring back. That's something that I didn't mention. Those are like the three days in a row where I do the E3 day one, day two, and day three recaps. Or if I want to do a recap on a Nintendo Direct or a Smash character reveal and their movesets and things like that. So recaps may be coming back, but I'm not 100% sure. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Be sure to stick around for the ride. We are still going strong. 2021 is our year. I'm saying it right now. Do me a favor, guys. If you enjoyed this video and are excited for some of the content coming within this year, then leave a like on this video, share it with some friends, and if you haven't already, smash that subscribe button for more content to come. I hope you'll stick around with me throughout 2021 and beyond, and I'll see you guys in the next video, and tonight on Twitch. Peace!